In my younger, more vulnerable years, my travels often led me to an old cloth maker. She would often regale me tales of her past and the tales of the three hopeful men who called themselves Dot Dream. This is their story. Hi, this is John, and this is week 90 of Dot Dream Devil. So, one, uh, first, I want to say thanks to everybody who, uh, who enjoyed my last week's devlog. Seems like people don't like me talking. <laughs> and when I don't talk, people seem to like to enjoy the video a lot more. Uh, but yeah, I'm, I don't have my equipment, so my audio quality is going to be a lot worse. And also, I'm in Taiwan, which is kind of crazy because this is the quarantine and I shouldn't be traveling, but I did. And I'll talk about that right after this. Um, right now, in the development lab for Brave Eduardo, we are actually holding a competition for people who can get past get the furthest down the dungeon. Well, we help. We were going to hold it, but right now we're pausing it because Juve and I are fixing a lot of stuff. And thanks to Stone and Lance going through the game rigorously, finding all the bugs, uh, we got to fix most of them. And a lot of them are very, very big system-wide stuff. And it seems like 3.5, which is the newest build, is running very smoothly. And we'll see by the end of tomorrow, we'll know. And if this goes like this, we will definitely going to be able to host the competition next week for a version 4. But anyways, so the story was I was, I, I got my package from Australia and my friend in Australia, we were sharing a snack packet. When I got her package, I was like, maybe I should do something for myself. And I immediately looked for a ticket to Taiwan because my parents are in Taiwan and I haven't been there in a while. So I was looking for a ticket prices and they're super expensive except for the one next day. So I was like, alright, I'm taking it. Immediately I started packaging and then like talked to Drew and talked to everybody that needed to be talked to. And then uh, the next day I took my I took a flight to Taiwan. And uh, once you're in Taiwan, you're going to be stuck in quarantine for about two weeks. So I'm going to be stuck in a room, uh, which hopefully means I'll have better productivity, but we'll see. I'll see you guys next week. Bye. It's not often that someone comes along who is a true fan and listens to the end. You are both. You shall find us here.